Please subscribe to this YouTube channel Mentor Talk and do press bell button for notifications. Well, legal implications surrounding the custodial death have been in the news for a while. Today, let me try to acquaint you about the law and policy regarding the subject of custodial death. The Indian law provides for a magisterial inquiry in relation to the custodial death. Section 176 of the Code of Civil Procedure directly deals with this eventuality. Section 176 subsection 1 of CRPC provides that a magistrate who has jurisdiction to hold inquests regarding an unnatural death may hold an inquiry into the cause of death and this will be in addition to the investigation held by the police officer. This provision grants the executive magistrate or the judicial magistrate the discretion to hold such an inquiry. This is section 176.1 uh, of CRPC I was talking about. Then there is section 176.1a which is a special provision while the previous provision of 176.1 is a general provision. Section 176.1a deals with the cases of death, disappearance or rape in police custody. The provision empowers and mandates the judicial magistrate or the metropolitan magistrate within whose local jurisdiction the offense has been committed to mandatorily hold an inquiry in addition to the inquiry on investigation held by the police. In the cases of death, disappearance or rape in the police custody. The, the fundamental ingredients of this special provision of 176.1a which makes it so special and different from the general section are that this inquiry is not an executive magisterial inquiry but a judicial inquiry by a judicial magistrate and it goes parallel with the police investigation not in addition it goes parallel with the police investigation and finally it is mandatory inquiry yes within 24 hours of the death of the person in the police custody the magistrate conducting inquiry in respect thereof is obligated to forward the body for examination to the nearest civil surgeon if that is not possible for some reason or reasons that reason or reasons must be recorded in writing by the magistrate Apart from the said provision of law, the National Human Rights Commission of India, NHRC in short, has also issued guidelines for a magisterial inquiry which expect the, the magistrate to inquire into you know, the, 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 the circumstances of death, the manner uh, and the whole series sequence of incidents leading to the death the uh, the cause of death uh, you know any person found responsible for the death or suspicion of any um, uh, foul play uh, you know which may emerged uh, which may emerge beg your pardon during the, the inquiry and even you know commission omission on the part of public servants that contributed to the to the death in the police custody adequacy of medical treatment provided to the deceased is also an important factor to be considered further nhrc requires that within 24 hours of the incidence of any custodial death the National Human Rights Commission must be given formal invitation in respect thereof and the magisterial inquiry must be concluded within two months of the incident with, with all inquiry reports, post-mortem reports, videography etc. sent to the commission. I feel that's all uh, for the time being, uh, hope you uh, found this video to be informative. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel Mentor Talk and do press bell button for notifications.